Are you pooing or- He's just pooed! You disgusting barbarian! Hi everybody, my name is Spamels and welcome back to Two Point Hospital. We are working our way up the hospital empire. Up next, either a university or a hillside hospital place, yay. What's it gonna be? Find out now! So without any more stalling, let's begin! Welcome back to the game! So here we are, this was our last hospital fluttering. What a lovely place it was. We went there, we smashed it, it's now doing tremendous well so up next we've got these two delightful places right here we can do the little town of tumble it's called there it is tumble everybody but then also we have mitten university i can't decide which one to do i think that the university might just be quite a big job to undertake so i'm gonna start slow we're going for tumble everybody tumble hospital welcome to tumble this small town attracts tourists from across the county to climb tumble ridge and hike along tumble downs lucky for us this generates hundreds of fractures bones each year catching well needs to build a fracture ward to deal with these injuries i recommend building a standard ward and other essentials too. Make sure to keep everybody warm with some radiators. Tumble has been known to experience seismic activity so look up for earthquake warnings. We all need janitors ready to deal with any damage. That could be cool. Are we gonna get earthquakes? Well, we clearly we are, otherwise they wouldn't say. Let's begin. This part of the county is quite cold. We need to put down some radiators to keep people warm. Fantastic. That is a small hospital. That's not particularly very big. So which way do customers come in? Which door do they use? Where's my reception going to go? I'm going to say this is the front door. Let's go with this. Reception desk. And then we have the waiting room right behind it. Because space is limited here. We need to be careful. I know. Stop giving me stupid tips I know all about. That's strange. Look at this. In the rooms, there is actually a reception room one can build so we could just put the reception desks down or i can actually build a proper reception room let's do that that could be cool what the hell no oh that whoa, 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 whoa. that is a big boy that's not a room that is literally the reception desk i don't like that back to old faithful here nothing will go wrong Ooh. you know what? i'm gonna hit play as i build i noticed like it was a bit sterile last episode because everything was frozen Right, we're going to put a GP's ward in because we need that first so people know what's wrong with them because they're silly sausages. So, one, two, three. It'll fit exactly there. One, two, three. And I can have like a, a walkway either side. I don't know. Let's go here. Ba, 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 Doorway there. I'm just going to boop this one out if you don't mind. <laughs> There we go. We've got our first GP's ward. Look at this. The brand new radiator. Now, can I see this area of effect like the plants sometimes show? Oh, yes. Okay, so that room is filling up with heat because of the heater. Amazing. I also got this brand new clown poster. We've got a light bulb head and clown man. Yes. Okay, I'm just going to throw a second GP's office up because you, you know you need your GP's. And you know there's going to be a mad rush of broken bone people running in quite literally saying, Doctor, help me. I fell down and I can't feel my leg and they're gonna go you're a silly sausage aren't you and then they die there we go second gp's ward is in and i forgot to add a bin to this one edit it just super quick bin done boom assistance all right i'm on it i'm on it higher sam tumbleweed you're hired uh blah 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 there he is Right, get to work, sir. I will continue building the hospital. Actually, I better hire some GPs real quick. Or right, Edna, get in there. Mick, get in there. Double doctors for double the diagnosis. Oh, I've got emails coming in. Diagnosis decision. One of our patients, Molly Blazer, has been sent to all of our diagnosis rooms, but we're only 83% sure of the diagnosis. You can ask them to wait around for more diagnosis rooms. Take the risk and treat them anyway, or send them home. I'm going to risk it for a biscuit. Get in there. Temperature's cold, I know. Fracture ward. Okay, get patient to wait. Right, come on. I believe in you. Ward is required. I know. You're know, pausing game. Pausing game. I'm getting stressed out. The ward is people demanding things of me. Okay, I'm throwing down a general diagnosis. This means GPs can then send the person to the middle room and I can put benches in front of it. It's going to be amazing. Okay, guys? Just believe in me. Blue, blue, blue. Everybody loves plants. Posters. <laughs> and a ready <radiator>. idea. <laughs> that room is done. Amazing. A blah. A nurse. Okay, hiring a nurse. Ooh, we got Rodney Sandwich. Robin Broccoli. Skyler Punia. I want sandwich. Give me sandwich. There you go, sandwich. Get to diagnosing. We need to make a waiting room for the people. So let's start throwing down benches. Just like this. It is amazing. See that heat? Oh, the heat looks like wee wee. Watch these two seconds. Whoa, get out of there. <laughs> there we go, right? So that is the beginnings of our hospital. Two GPs and a. Some patients should be ashamed of their condition. 
They should Mildred. They should. Right, let's start building things. So what do I need? Thermal comfort. We're, we're nearly there on that thermal comfort. 50 patients cured. God damn it. What's wrong with you? Oh, you want a pharmacy. Oh, God. This, the essentials. One, two, three. One, two, three. My pharmacy's going there, everybody. <laughs> This room is done! We need another nurse. More nurses! Get in here. There you go. A patient has given a Britty for a fracture ward and is storming out. Unlucky. What's wrong with you? Thirsty and hungry. Okay, God. People are so picky. I want healing. I want food as well. Look, the hospital wasn't built when you arrived. Be patient. Ha ha ha. I want to build the next rooms before we start throwing down the vending machines and stuff. So, bone clinic. What's the minimum size on this bad boy? A four. Oh, that's, that's going to go there pretty well. Let's do that. This is a strange ward. What is that some sort of portal that's going to take me to Beelzebub's lair? Oh, it's a plaster caster. Whoa, that's huge. Do I need this? Apparently, I need the traction beds. Have I got to make this room bigger? Build it. There you go. Right, another nurse required. Usha Duckworth. She's expensive, but she's bloody amazing at what she does. Start the game. Right, now people should stop moaning and should get healthy. And that's going to make life great. I am worried that there's only one bed. Maybe I should have made the room bigger, have multiple beds. We'll see how it goes. Oh, look at that. Double plants by the doors. That's lovely. So this is the hospital so far. It's coming together. It's kind of balanced as well. Let's get some on the right-hand side. We're going to make a ward and something else. I don't know. Oh, there's so many letters. Ward required. A patient with Porter's head is seeking treatment. From Promotion. Not now, Mildred. Fracture emergency. There's been an outbreak of fracture ward related illness after complications from testing Bungle's mind controlled jetpack. A group of testers are looking for treatment. A group? I've already got the one bed. Cure five patients. A new illness. Hearty leg discovered. Great. No, I'm not promoting staff. I'm busy. Look at this. What's We're sorry for the litter that you dropped on our floor. Oh, I like that, Mildred. Oh, I like that. Step in. And then when you pop out, you're going to be feeling much better. They're saw blades. Oh, did you just change into a man? Oh, they've got things. They're the emergency case. One's having a lie down. Shall I make another ward? Nursing station, changing screen. Where are the beds? Where are the beds? I am not happy with... What are you doing? You are not Doctor Who of a sonic screwdriver. You know what? I'm making it the whole length. We're doing this. It's going to be the greatest ward that ever warded. This ward is going to win awards. Ah, oh, plants. Earthquake. Warning. Earthquake imminent. Oh, no. Don't panic. It's a hospital. You're in the exact place that you need to be if you get hurt in an earthquake. Hiring a nurse for this place. Boof. Right, back to edit. I didn't finish doing the room. Um, So edit, edit, edit. Boof, boof, boof. Will one heat to be enough? I can't tell if that's good or bad. It could be warmer. All the nurses are called Mildred. Perfect. That's much better. And each bed is getting a poster behind it to remind people that people go in beds and nothing else. That ward looks absolutely fantastic. Oh, yeah. Benches. I need to... Blue, 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 blue. How about that? That's amazing. It's balanced. It's lovely. It's beautiful. And it's got a bit of privacy. What have you done? There's a puddle of pee on the floor. Or is it a puddle of cheesy gubbins? Who knows? Janitors, could you get on that fast? Yeah, hi. Good job, janitor. Mop that up. It's dust. That that pee turns into dust. Okay. Oh, there's a big steel. We haven't got toilets. Someone's cracks on the floor. No, don't bring me. You'll smudge it in. Toilets. I should have built toilets. I'm so sorry, people. I'm so sorry. Hold on. No, 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 no. Are you pooing or... He's just pooed. You disgusting barbarian. Well, uh, mate, I'm building the toilet right now. If you can stop pooing on the floor, maybe we could be friends. Are you... Oh, someone's just been sick. It's all going on in that corridor, isn't it? Yes! People can now poo in a toilet and not on the floor. Oh, there's a long line for the fracture. We need a bigger fracture ward. There's six people waiting to get their fractures unfractured. It seems kind of long and stretchy. Let's do it like this. Mildred lives there. The bone station is there. And then beds take up the rest of the ward. That's a bit better. No, no. Unhappy sounds. You'll just open the room. Because I can finish building it with people going in it. Nursey. I need a nursey. There you go, nursey. That room is now ready. That guy's having a poo in the toilet. Oh, no, he's being sick in the toilet. That person's pooing. But well, we've nearly cleaned up our emergency case. That's a VIP. That's amazing. Okay, okay. We need more rooms and fast. Dulux clinic. I think that's maybe what I needy. Let's try building over this side. So one, two, three. One, two, three. This is going to make people feel better. Because reasons. 
Build it! There we go, right. Tire another doctor. Blue of Pan's lab. Can that be a three by three? Damn it, it can't! Oh, light bulb head! How is it going, sir? Here we go, it's gonna unscrew this for you, my man. You might feel a slight pinch. Oh, your light gone up, not to worry. So I wiggle on this, and then that head, that's the head of your dreams. Have a look at that. You can't, you haven't got a head. Let me help you out on that, and I'll wiggle this a bit more. Here comes the head! Prepare for getting head. You have received head with a complimentary free hat. Great success! My cardiology is going in there. Boof! <laughs> Open! Nursey! I need another bloody nursey. See, look at that. We've already got a patient coming in. Look at this, look at this. Plenty of heat for everybody that needs it. That is looking fantastic. Okay, we haven't got a staff room yet, and we haven't got a pan slab place. So let's cure more people. Pan slab! Get on it, quick! Pan slab! Everybody loves good pans. How big is this room before by Jesus? Build it! There we go. Right. Should I focus more on wards? There's people lining up. There's five people. Wait, right. We need another ward urgently. Oh, God. I'm the worst. Don't let anyone hear this, but I haven't got a clue what I'm doing. Look at all these beds. Oh, we are absolutely bed bathing and beyonding it up in here. Right, right, right. Change your station. I got room. Yes, we got room. No, we don't. That's gonna block a bed. Oh, changey station, you're ruining everything. I don't want to lose the bed because of a stupid changey station. I've got to lose the stupid bed because of the stupid changey station. It's happening. Ooh, no, no, no. After some rejiggling, we've worked it out with everybody. It's not a lot of room for anything else, but I don't care. Plants make people feel slightly less sick. I right, open the wards. Boof! Nursey, get in here. Right. Our right, heaters are going in now. There you go. Is that making you feel better? There's pee on the floor there. Do watch out. Another guy just died! Portis head. Oh, because I've got the... I need the pants! The pants lab is here. They, they died waiting for the pants lab, it seems. That's not my fault. Warning! Seismic activity has been detected in this area. This could damage our machinery. Oh, no! Staff room. Let's get a staff room in. Not that the staff deserve a staff room. Right. It's rumbling. We're fine. Everyone's alive. Fantastic. We need more GPs. I've got 10 and 9 people waiting. This is not good. I haven't got room. Okay, hang on. Let's just get this thrown in. Vending machines first. I need to get a janitor that can take care of ghosts because this is ridiculous. Oh! Okay, staff room is done. See, this ward is like massive and it's barely being used. Shall I shut down the smaller break wards and just use the larger one? Yeah, I'm closing this one down. Close it down. Sell it. Sell the room for 14 grand. Boof. Right. We're going to build another GP's office because we need them GP's. And this one's going to be a slightly larger than a normal GP's office. So it could be the super GP's office. Made for super important GP's. Plant, 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 plant. Boom. Okay, we've got a new GP's office. Hire a GP. Uh, this person is expensive but bloody amazing. Okay, we've got to cure 11 more patients and then we're out of here. Oh, there's a ghost busting janitor. We need you. There's probably ghosts around there. A rival hospital owned by Mr. Weeble has a reputation of over 84%. Ours is already 71. God damn it, Weeble. Train. I'm not training staff. Get out of here. Promotion. Stop asking for money. I'm Scrooge McDuck and you're not getting anything. Someone just died. Why did you die? There's that janitor who can take care of ghosts. Here he is. He's got a vacuum cleaner. He's sucking up that ghost. There you go. Good job, sir. You deserve a pat on the head. Are we making money? No, we're losing 13 grand a month. This hospital is not successful. Right, there's a thing to see the patients, right? Yeah, patients, this here. Okay, people are nearly dead. This person's about to die. You are literally about to die. Heading for queue. No, 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 you're front of the queue. You're f Get into the room now! You are literally about to die, Davina Hawk. I'm sorry to push you to the front of the line, but you need to get diagnosed and then treated immediately. I don't feel so good. Get out there. Oh! A letter for me! Congratulations, your hospital has been awarded a one-star rating by the Tripod Health Ministry. <gasps> you are doing a smashing job on gluing back together all those witness activity bandits. I have never seen the appeal of pursuits al fresco myself land should be owed and profited from, not used as venue for wanton permabulation. <laughs> Continue with your astrological upkeep for more rewards or go on elsewhere to expand your organization. That's the friendliest the guy's ever been. He's normally told me how he wishes I'd crash and burn. I feel like I've let this hospital down. I mean, sure, we've cured a lot of people of their illnesses. What else did we do? We put heaters in so they're no longer cold. But I don't think the hospital was running at a profit. Maybe it now is. I don't know. I killed many people this time. 
That was an oopsie. That was a big oopsie. Anyway, that said, I'm amazing. I'm moving on. This hospital is done. I guess we're not getting narration because this one is still here to be done. I guess I'm doing the, the university next time, everybody. Midden University. So what's this? Career. Oh, look at this. The webcam is still over there. I forgot about that. Collect uh, Q100 patients. I collect a reward. Oh, earn a million dollars. Oh, oh, there's more. Repair 100 machines. Oh, one to 100 plus. Oh, upgrade five machines. Oh, that's it. That's all we got there. Oh, no, there's more. Earn 1,000 kudos. Even more kudos. Yay. How do I see how much kudos I have now? Right. Well, that was the adventures of Tumble Hospital. Did you enjoy this? If you did, leave a comment down below of your thoughts and opinions. Coming up next episode, we're jumping into the university. We're going to teach people a thing or two about healthcare and keeping people alive. Because I've got a great track record of doing that. I'm over here now. Anyway, on that bombshell, thank you for watching. Rate, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next episode. Goodbye, everybody.